We have some new videos popping up online showing people swarming beaches, pools and churches. This was the big concern. It's also raising concerns about the lack of social distancing. ABC's Inez de la Quatera explains that some states are now seeing an increase in the number of new COVID-19 cases. Overnight, new images of crowds coming out in droves for the holiday weekend, but many not following social distancing guidelines. In Southern California, a popular hiking trail forced to close after large crowds showed up. In Ocean City, Maryland, thousands flocked to the boardwalk, some without masks. It's really crowded. It's beautiful out. You know, it's fun. Everybody's having fun. At the Jersey Shore, business owners happy to reopen. It's insane on how many people are out here today. Yeah. I didn't expect this at all. Aerial images from Florida showing people swarming Daytona Beach. There's two people out the sunroof throwing money. Police referring to the scene as a gauntlet. This type of behavior is unacceptable. We don't want people coming to our city, disrupting our city. Many places of worship also reopening for the first time this Sunday. Congregants sitting apart at this church in Alabama. Uh, I talked with my deacons and they uh, agreed that we felt like that we could do this, uh, do this safely and that it was a good and it was the right thing to do. With all 50 states now easing some form of social distancing restrictions, at least eight are seeing an increase in new reported cases. In Santa Cruz County, California, new concerns Mother's Day celebrations may have contributed to a 20 percent spike in cases. And in Arkansas, officials say a high school pool party led to a second spike. And New York Governor Andrew Cuomo announcing professional sports teams can return to their facilities for training. This as Major League Baseball, the NBA and NHL continue discussions with their players unions about resuming their seasons. Inez de la Quatera, ABC News, Washington.